Imagine you found a dream house you love, but you have pesky neighbors trying to steal your food and sleep in your bed. Now, envision a storm destroyed all the other houses. Competition for your dream house just got a little bit more difficult. My name is Jacob Yurick, and I'm researching the interactions and ecology between territorial damselfish like this jewel damsel. My research aim is to address how habitat use and competition changes after a disturbance like a cyclone. I chose to conduct this study at Lizard Island on the northern Great Barrier Reef for this very reason. Unfortunately, we've been hit by two large cyclones in the last 12 months or so. In April 2014, this area here got hit very hard by Cyclone Ida, and then again in March 2015, Cyclone Nathan came through and hit approximately the same area. Fortunately, the lagoon proper itself and the areas right out in front of the research station um, didn't get near so bad, so they're still bad. Due to the lagoon missing the cyclone's impact, we can see how fish living in a pristine fishbowl directly compares to fish living in a recently degraded fishbowl. Applying this analogy to my research, the fishbowl is the variety of habitats available to the fish, the competitive interactions between neighboring fish, and the characteristics of the reef itself. So, how do we learn about these fish and their natural habitats? It all comes down to these clipboards with underwater paper, a tape measure, and just getting in. We start by laying out the tape measures on different habitat types, like this site dominated by soft coral, different hard coral dominated reefs, or sites that recently got hit by the cyclone. To assess what the habitat is, we identify what's under the line, and sometimes we need our handy field guides to help. On the same lines, we then count, identify, and size all of the neighboring competing fish. We take these surveys one step further for damselfish, the most abundant bottom associated fish with quite a feisty attitude. We document their habitat preference and other ecological metrics to see how their ecology and behavior changes. Despite their relatively little stature, territorial damselfish are important contributors to the overall biodiversity of coral reef benthic communities. As climate change associated threats, like the frequency of high intensity cyclones due to rising sea surface temperatures, increase, it becomes more important to learn about the damselfish before they're in distress. Mm -hmm.